is a drawing of the layout of the buildings. I've been asked quite a lot of questions in the comments about the layout and people are getting a little bit confused because there's quite a few buildings. So I thought I'd just film this again. I have filmed this once before. I think it was in episode 12. I'm hoping that this tree is going to fall this way. I'm getting ready to run here. So <laughs> right, I'm getting ready to get out of the way here very quickly. I'm hoping Tony's gonna do the same. I'm worried it's going to go like that. Oh, it moved, it moved. Right. It's going. It moved. It's going. Right, everybody out of the way. Oh my word, where's it going? It's coming in the right direction. Oh wow. Oh. <laughs> right. Now hang on, Tone. Tone, you need to take up the slack. Add, he needs to take up the slack else it's going to go in the water. Do you not think it's going to go that way? You haven't took the slack. Tone, stop. Right, the cable is now loose, still attached to the digger, but it isn't taut. So we're just discussing whether it's a good idea to take up the slack on the cable before Tony makes that final cut, just in case it decides it wants to escape into the river. <laughs> right, what's the plan now? Right, we're just gonna reposition the cable. Yeah. What this side of this tree? Yeah. This yeah, we're gonna undo it. Oh, I'm not. There, I'm going to undo it. Oh, hang on. Ah. They can't undo it. They're <laughs> gonna drive the digger. I think. Around the tree? Oh, maybe not. I'm hoping that this is just to stop it from falling in the river, and that it, I'm hoping that they're not going to damage my tree because that tree there is my sweet chestnut tree. Anyway, it's survived so far. Oh, 
Right. Oh, right, okay, you're yeah, there. There is an old stump right next to that tree. Oh, 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 oh. Hang on. Wow. Mind your chainsaw. Stop. You're about to squash your chainsaw. That's not going in the river now, is it? <laughs> Where's it? Oh, you're just pulling it. Wow. Mm. It's huge. Look, it stretches right across that side of the garden there. How tall is that, Tone? How tall is that tree? 12, well, Adam said 12 metres. There's a competition now, isn't there? Well, maybe to the end, yeah. Yeah. I think you might even be taller than that, to be honest. That's it. We'll, we'll start up a chainsaw in business. Do, At least 12. <laughs> have, have a nice little bonfire. So, a little bonfire. Mind you, it's going to be some more firewood, isn't it? Yeah. Right. Another job for you, Tone. Wow. That's exciting. So, obviously you're going to tidy that little bit up now, Tone. Look, yeah. I'm going to chop this tree up now so we can get it out of the way. Oh. Adam, you are been looking for the cold. <laughs> Tony's using Adam's petrol uh, chainsaw. He's used to his electric one. tree stump. Obviously Tony will tidy this bit up which as you can see look at these huge roots that have grown into the wall. Look at these huge roots they've grown into the wall um, and obviously we don't want the same thing happening as did on the other side with the other tree. The digger can even help with chopping up the tree. It's going to lift it up a bit so it's easier for Tony. So his blade's not hitting the ground. Hey! Oh! <laughs> I'll do it the old fashioned way, yeah, with, with the two. Yeah. He's going to put the foot. 
next to it and then just pick it up slightly. Hey. Oh! It's heavy. That's better. Some big old cable they used, isn't it? Hot, isn't it? You've got some, haven't you? Hey? Have you got some? Yeah, Is it because it's trying to cut green wood? No, it's just you've got not enough oil to get through the chain. Oh, right, okay. Is that what makes it smoke like yeah. that? Oh, yeah, right, it's, it's not the tree catching it's light. Trying to burn its way. Through, right? to burn its way. <laughs> we get there somehow. When you start using it like a, like a handsaw, <laughs> it's probably <laughs> something wrong. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we go again. Is it an easy start one, Tone? Pardon? Actually, that was easy to start. to be working either. Can you sharpen a chainsaw, Tony? No. I wouldn't put your fingers on it. Do, do you just change the blade or do you get it sharpened? Uh, you sharpen it. Oh well I don't know, I wouldn't know but so you need a you need a yeah you need to drop it into the uh, garden machinery place then. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah. Is Tony going to use his? Yeah, so. Alright. Alright, we've tried oiling the blade now, see if that helps. Okay. Alright, I'm just going to give it another go and see if that's helped. No, it doesn't seem to be doing much. Up and fight that one. Hey. Oh dear. Mm. Right. Yeah, yeah, I think Tony's getting his backup one out. Yeah. 
Right. Two Bob Sawyer, see? Two Bob Sawyer. Oh my God, style are going to sue me now, aren't they? <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's caught on film. Yeah, this is yeah. not... This video is not sponsored by Steel. Steel? Steel? Or whatever, make Tony's chainsaw is. This video is not sponsored. Yeah, it's very not sponsored by <laughs> it? We wouldn't be making a very good job of it if we did. <laughs> this is in no way Steele's responsibility. This is Adam's responsibility for not sharpening his blades. <laughs> Much better. So you just need a sharp blade. That's your work zone. Uh, <laughs> 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 this video is not sponsored by work zone either. This is actually a video on how not to use a chainsaw or how not to maintain a chainsaw. up a little bit and pick it up again for Tony to saw it hey much easier when it's up in the air oh actually yeah we have a third one are you going to try and wreck that one as well? I'm just going to look for it now. <laughs> How to maintain your... What is it? It's a... Chainsaw. How to maintain your chainsaw. <laughs> Part one. Remember to put oil in it occasionally. Chain oil. Ah! Now. Yes, yeah, so there's a third one. Which... Do we have another backup one? That's going to do the other end. Is this a chainsaw competition? Three chainsaws and not a sharp one between them. the thicker end. The sun's struggling on the left here. I think Ad, Ad's coming up fast behind Tony. I think Tony's just giving out. And Tony looks like he has problems in the smoke department. Which one of them's going to get there first? I'm not sure what one of them are going to get there. <laughs> hey, Tony won. <laughs> Now that tree's like a seesaw down. Yeah, Adam was close, but no, no, no cigar. <laughs> That's quite exciting. <laughs> Yeah, Adam's got 
got the fat the <laughs> Adam's got the fat bit on that end. He's trying to finish off the job that he started at that end. Tony has got the slight advantage at this end. I'm sure you slightly smaller on this end. Smaller in diameter. Neither of the chainsaws is working as according as it should. <laughs> oh, don't chop your fingers, Tone. two in quick succession <laughs> yeah I think that's slightly better now you put some oil in that one as well but I think they all need sharpening but oh here we go see Tony's not good at these easy start things Moving now. Chainsaws, this one is definitely the fastest.
there. And the chainsaw was that what? Was that the one? No, that's where we go back. Oh, that's Adam's, that. is it? Yeah, put him in there, yeah. Okay. Have you put the other one away? Yes. Hang on. Now, we've just been clearing up. We're going to have a bottle of wine. I just thought I'd show you this because this is one of our, it's a very small bin, like wine area, but this is one of our local ones. Can see. And it says on the top there, at the heart of the France. At the heart of France. And this is very, very good wine. And we're sitting out in the back garden down by the river as you can see so we're going to have a glass of wine what are we doing here? some garden planning? ok so what, I'm going to, what I think I'll do is if I move my timber if I cut to, to, to lengths that I want yeah and then I move it to here yeah. Is that a good storage yeah, spot? I really ought to level it up first, shouldn't I, before you do, yeah. do all that. Yeah. So, but you've got, to, you've got to cut your tip. Yeah, but most of them are yeah. four metre pieces. Alright, so we've got to cut the timbers to length. Then bring them out here, and where are we going to put them? Will you have already had your bonfire by then? No. I'm no. Bonfire, probably tomorrow night. Okay. Aunt right, Tanya and Adam are out here discussing where they're going to put things. Have you guessed what Tony's building? He's building it for me. And no, it's not a new house. <laughs> it's quite a lot of it. Now there's another shaped piece here. This is the only one that's going to be that shape. The two pieces go together. This is a raised bed. The reason it's an odd shape is because the wall is not square with the barn building. So we're going to line the rest of them up square. And this is what Tony's making me some very, very long veggie beds for my potager. And it's going to be much easier for me to garden it because they're going to be raised by about 400. That's going to make it much easier for me to do it. Exactly. Of course. Hold it, Vin Jane's got to film it. We were still fairly high. Okay. Oh, okay, it's just keeping it straight, is it? Pardon? <laughs> Trouble is you're sending smoke signals. Right, uh, the roofing work is still going on. They're moving all the scaffold. They're gonna start around the back here. Wow. It looks smart now you've leveled it all out, look. Uh, 
Ah. Au! Why? Why? Well, I'll have to do it from this side, won't I? This is the idea. Although it does look a bit strange. It does look a bit strange, that shape, but... Nah, that's not right, Tone. You got it the wrong way round. It's not right, is it? It's meant to be in line with... Well, mind you, it might be. Is it actually in line with the side of the barn? It looks quite weird, actually. It's the right way round. It's the right way round, yeah. Now, this is meant to square it up with the... Yeah. the barn. So this is why it's such a strange shape because the wall goes on an angle and it's meant to compensate it's meant to line up with the side of the barn and it doesn't look quite right but I think it might be a bit of an optical illusion Tell me when you think that it's straight that shit Okay, that end wants to go that way. That way? Yeah. yeah. It's not far off then, is it? Well, this is far off, isn't it? It's just, it's an optical illusion, isn't it? No, it's too far. That needs to go back more to the wall. I think this end might have to be slightly shorter, that's... How do we work it out then to make it square? <laughs> um, I've usually got quite a good eye, but you can't really tell because it narrows. It's difficult to tell. The only thing you can do is run a plank right the way along that wall. I don't know. <laughs> Ah, uh, string line, here we go. Tony, I knew Tony would have the answer. <laughs> A string line. Even the wall's not straight, but... Whoops, I'm falling over things. Well, there's less to fall over now. What? No, it needs to come to me, I think. You can't even tell if the wall's straight, Tone. <laughs> it's still not quite right, is it? But then, I, th here, I think it's an optical illusion tone. I think if you take that piece of string, no, that's what I'm saying. It's like it's one of them. <laughs> <laughs> 
Maybe it'll sound right when you do it. Yeah. Are you recording this, Jane? Sorry? Are you recording this? Yes. Is that okay? No, it's not. No, it's not okay because Tan doesn't like being filmed. It, uh, yeah, it just it just looks weird. If you stand back here, it looks better now with a bit of string. Because that's where my path's going to be, about where that bit of string is. <laughs> so you were right? Yeah. Because you're pretty much right against the string, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Shows so you the angle of that, though, doesn't it? A different angle on the wall. Are we going further back to the wall? Yeah. Yeah. We'll be going further, further to the wall, closer to the wall. Yeah, close to the wall, please. Has it got to have a gap to breathe or? I'll trust you to find the only route. <laughs> 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 